Hi friends and thank you for tuning in. Today we will be going inside of a abandoned movie theater. So right now you see we're upstairs. We're in the um, projector room. Yeah, I was really confused on that. I, <laughs> I thought that the <laughs> that they would be worth a lot and people would have taken them out. Those are apparently the big reels for the film. It's just the tiles came up full of concrete. Those slides are really neat. I guess they would play those at the beginning for each film that they had. These are the different the theaters. Fire, yeah. yeah, unfortunately yeah. someone had started a fire. It looked like with it oil and they had fire. paper included with there. So and they had it <laughs> they had it in a mop bucket from downstairs it looked like again these are the projectors that would look out for each of the theater rooms and I guess one of the reasons why they aren't worth that much is because of digital film now So we're coming up on the office. You'll see the office had a little window that looked out. So at first we thought this was a um, a break <laughs> a break room coming up. I was like, this is really legit. It's much but mm -hmm, it's actually kind of nice. Yeah, yeah. But. You keep walking back here and you see you see two two twin beds. So what I'm thinking is they had maybe the projector people live live at this location. I'm assuming this lo this location was a little bit farther out, but This is strange. So, we take a walk downstairs. Come up to my house. Where do you live at? Come over here. So, that area would have been closed off to customers. Yeah, it was it was really 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 dark. So we were unfortunate. But so this is the lobby room. You see, <laughs> um, behind the counter they had, of course, the concessions, the candy, the popcorn, the sodas. Someone it looked like had a candle that had been caught on fire. There's a logo. So, this theater was neat um, because a lot of the seats and the screens were still there, 
most of the areas you see that you do go into nowadays, they're completely cleared and there's nothing there. So. But this was the RC Theater. I'm not going to give you a location, but it, it opened in 93 and it closed close to, I'd say, early 2013. It had four theater rooms. But I'm wondering if this location had been been prone to flooding so I'm sure the insurance the rates and the clientele that would come down here wouldn't be able to sustain you know this place but I thank you for watching and enjoying my video take care and I hope you like the voiceovers <laughs> thank you thanks for watching bye